Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon and welcome to another Monday vlog. Another week gone by and a very, very big week for me personally. Um, in relation to the channel itself, it's been, you know, uh, a standard week, although we have finally finished The Clone Wars with those eight unfinished episodes. We finished that off yesterday. Um, it was very, I mean, it, the stories are very good. It was very unusual seeing a story, uh, you know, a, a show not fully animated. Um... It was just very awkward to watch, but I still enjoyed them. I'm going to be doing a short review on those eight episodes. I'll probably get that up a little bit later on tonight. Um, I'm also going to be putting the Flash reaction up um, later on tonight. Apologies for not getting that up on Sunday's normal. I will go into detail a little bit further on this video because it has been a very busy uh, few days for me. Um, with regards to what's going ahead this week... We have, um, in fact, it's it's a pretty big week coming up. Um, I'm going to try and start getting in the new Clone Wars. Um, it depends on whether I can get the review for the uh, Clone Wars we've just finished off. I wanna I wanna put together a big review with you know things like my top five favorite story arcs, top five worst episodes, top five top episodes, you know things like that. Um, I want to come up with all sorts of different ideas for this big review. I want to put a lot of work into it. I might not be able to get it done before the weekend. I might put a lot of my weekend hours coming up into this. Um, so that I can have a really nicely polished review. I feel the Clone Wars really deserves uh, a review that has had a lot of work put into it. So what I'm probably going to do is I might wait until the weekend. put you know Bring up my, uh, my ideas through the week. Dedicate the weekend to making that video um and you know then produce that for maybe the monday um and then we can move on to the new clone well the new old clone wars from 2003 before finally i mean that's only gonna be very short because they come in very short episodes uh before finally moving on to the winner of the vote which currently is avatar um there is still about a week left to vote for anyone who hasn't voted you can find that tagged on the channel uh, right now, if you you know if you click back onto my homepage and you're subscribed, you'll see that video. It should be there, dead center. If you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, and you know, once we, once that vote is wrapped up in about a week's time, we will then go and move on to that reaction series. Which uh, again, at the moment, it's tied between Legends of Tomorrow and Avatar. But I say tied, Av Avatar is you know quite a few votes ahead. But really, they're the two most likely outcomes. Um. Yes, so big plans for the end of the weekend. Sunday and Monday is the E3 press conferences. Now, what I'm going to be doing is on the Sunday, I'm going to be live on Twitch for all of the press conferences. I'm going to be joined by Full Metal COS. I'll be joined by Hitch. And I think Soul Steel is going to come along, come along as well. I would love it if you guys could come along with me, watch the streams live. We're going to be talking about what's going on. You can, you know, you can talk to us as well. You can all share in our reactions and our reviews as to all of the different uh, press conferences. I think it starts with Bethesda at 7 p.m. UK time on the Sunday. So, uh, as I say, what I'll do is a little bit later in the week, I'll put up a video just advertising the times when we're going to be live, uh, where we're going to be. Because on the Monday, rather than me being live here in this room, I'm going to be live at Full Metal COS's place. And we're going to be watching the Monday press conferences from his place on my channel. Um, so that's going to be pretty awesome. You're going to get live reactions from us both in the same room. Uh, so we'll see how that works out. But I would love it if you guys could come and join us. As I say, we will um, we'll definitely be interacting with you guys in the chat as always. We'll be wanting to get your thoughts on what's going on. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, in relation to Twitch, my streaming schedule, I'm going to be updating that. By the time this video goes live, my Twitch schedule should be updated. I am planning on uh, streaming maybe four times this week. Uh, I want to get a very short stream out tonight. Maybe do a little bit of Hearthstone, only for a couple of hours, because again, I'm very short on time today. But uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, we are going to be having um, longer three to four hour streams. Um, Thursday, again, is going to be Star Wars Friday. Um, simply because Friday I was originally going to have it there, but again, from a video that I'm going to put up later in this week, tied into E3, uh, Full Metal COS is going to be doing a 24 hour live stream on Friday, and I, I'm going to be doing some co-oping with him on that. He's going to be raising money for charity, uh, Macmillan Cancer Support, um, so it would be greatly appreciated if anyone could again pop along, um, and say hello, 
donate to charity. It's a really good cause. I'm going to be there playing some games with him. Um, you know, he's going to be in for a real tough slog over 24 hours. And it's going to be a lot of fun. And I didn't want to sort of disrespect that stream by streaming over it. So I've moved my Friday stream to Thursday. And I'm going to be a part of the Friday stream over on his channel. So again, um, I'll pop his channel description in the link below. My channel description for Twitch is going to be in the link below as well. If you haven't followed me there, please do. We have an awesome time. All of the guys there will attest to it. We've got a fantastic community. Um, but there's about 25 to 30 regular viewers who come along. And we talk about all sorts. We play all sorts of games. We get on really well. We're all like really close friends. And I love it there. I love my live streams. Um, you know, it's it's absolutely amazing. And um, that's why I'm putting so much effort into YouTube and Twitch. And it's, you know, it's very time consuming. Of, you know, sometimes it can be very taxing. But it's more than worth it. Because you guys here on YouTube are amazing. You know, with all the comments you leave. And the nice, you know, the, the supportive um, messages that I get. And again, on Twitch. The live interaction in the chat is amazing. We have a great community there. So, yeah, that's the plans for the channel. Um, very quickly going into my personal, uh, what's happening personally for me over the last week. Anyone who's been keeping up to date with me over the last few months has known that I've been planning to move to Scotland um, to be with my partner, Alex. Now, the, but the planned move date is uh, the very end of July. Um, now, again, we haven't really been doing too much to try and sort things just yet. Uh, well, up until this week, just gone. Because, again, it's very difficult to try and find a place to, to move into a no new job role until you're a bit close to the time. This week, just gone. Um, I've arranged a transfer from my job down here in Liverpool to my job's headquarters up uh, where I'm going to be living. <clears throat> so that's really exciting. That was one of my big worries. But I managed to get that boxed off. Um, and I can move up there. I'll be starting on the 1st of August. It's not going to be any worries whatsoever. It's just gone very smoothly, and I'm very grateful, you know, um, for the way that's, that's been done. Also, over the weekend, uh, myself and Alex went uh, to search for some places, and I was driving down on there, uh, sorry, driving up on the Friday night, and I got a message. We, we'd booked in, I think it was four or five places for viewings on the Saturday. Anyone who has viewed flats, you know, to move into places, you know how stressful it can be trying to get the bookings. You've got to get in there quick because if someone else sees it, someone else gets a view in before you do and they snap it up, it's gone, you know. Um, and especially living, you know, fr from where I'm going to be moving to, I live currently about three and a half hour drive away. So it is uh, very difficult to be able to get up there to view places before someone else, you know, can snap them up. So I got met, I booked, um, you know, uh, two different places, I think. And I got messages from them to say, you know, on the Friday night that, you know, your viewings have been cancelled. Um, and Alex got the same from another two on his side. And it was like, what the hell? What What's, you know, we've got one viewing left. You know, we'd arranged this all for a week and we had one viewing left. And I was like, wow, what's, what's going on? Am I driving all this way up here, you know, uh, just for the one viewing? I mean, yeah, it's great to spend time, you know, with Alex. But at the same time, it's also going to be very serious in trying to find a flat. Um, so we were kind of panicking a bit and we thought, well, okay, we'll, we'll go to this viewing and we'll see what it's like. So we went and saw the flat and wow, it was amazing. It's in a really nice area. Uh, it's a fairly new building. It's a really big, spacious place. Um, I'd been, I was planning where I was going to have my computer desk. I'm probably going to put my computer desk in the, uh, the living area rather than like a bedroom. Um, so it gives me a bit more freedom to, you know, sort of stream whenever I want. Because one of the concerns I have here while I'm living with other people is I've got people below me. I live on the top floor of this house. I've got people who are directly below me. So if I stream late at night, I've got to be conscientious about, you know, noise. Um, although I don't always worry about that. I'm sometimes just an entity upon myself. So I don't have to worry about that uh, if I have it in the, the living area where the bedroom's going to be all the way back, you know, on the other side of the apartment. So we saw this, it was really, really good. And really, you know, it was, it was just about in our budget range. And we thought, you know, we've got to make a move for this. We've got to make a move. So, um, you know, we, we contacted the estate agent and we were waiting for a couple of hours. We went to get a coffee and, you know, some, some breakfast. And we were just waiting on like uh, a nerve's end to get some news. And about an hour later, they phoned us as we were driving to the estate agents. And they said, yeah, uh, we got the place. So, um, yeah, it's all sorted. The move up to Scotland is a go, and we have now got a pending date of the around the twenty ninth of July is when it's going to be happening. So probably around that time, the channel is going to be not very active for a few days whilst I get my setup on the go, get the internet set up, 
um, you know, get a few bits and bobs. I'll need a new computer desk and things like that. Um, so there'll be a few days where I'm, I'm not so active just whilst I get everything set up. But once I'm there, wow, are things going to be different. I'm going to have a lot more, um, you know, freedom to do things that I need. I'm going to get a green screen. Um, we're going to have a lot of fun. Again, I'm, I'm uncertain on whether I'm going to continue on with the green screen permanently. I want to see how it looks. If it looks good, we'll carry on with it. Green screen to some people is a bit of a, a gimmick, um, you know, and some people prefer just having the view as it is. Um, but we'll see how it works out. So, yeah, that's why it's been a really stressful sort of long week. Um, but now it's all boxed off. I can just take a breather, get my stuff ready to move and, you know, just focus purely on uh, what needs to be focused on the channel streaming. So, yes, all of that stuff has happened in the space of a week. And uh, it's been a, like, like, that's why I say it's been a big week in terms of me personally for the channel. It's been, you know, a fairly average week, but the week we've got coming up for the channel is going to be huge. E3, Full Metal's live stream for 24 hours for charity. Um, you know, we're gonna have the new reactions, the Clone Wars review, the big Clone Wars review that we're gonna have a you know a lot of a lot of time and effort put into that. It's gonna be great. So, guys, I would really, really appreciate it if you could join me for any of my live streams, any of Full Metal COS's uh, stream on Tuesday, the E3 stream next week. Um, if, if you haven't subscribed or follow me on Twitch, um, please do. Uh, you know, it really does I really do appreciate it. It does support me so much. I really can't wait for this week coming up. It's going to be amazing, guys. As always, thank you for your support. You are the ones who drive me to do this. You're the ones who give me the passion to do this. I love making videos for you guys. I love streaming for you guys. I love playing games. I love doing everything you know, that I do for you guys. It's amazing. So, yes, until I see you again, guys, take care, and I will see you very soon.